So Albert, after all that you have told us today, I guess all of the people are going to wonder, what should we do? Right, also about that, I brought you a few messages that I'm going to read. Apparitions Jacare, Brazil, 2018. There are many souls to save, my children. So now you must be brave soldiers. Pay attention. Fast and quick. And you have to bring my word everywhere. First of all, the messages we have seen so far are of incalculable importance, although a lot of people are careless and unaware of this. Let's do what Our Lady asked, with the speed and swiftness. Let's spread them everywhere. Also because people are taking path with no way out and no way back. With these liquids and the stamp which is coming. So, let's hurry up. And she said everywhere. Now, you've probably already heard me in my previous videos. Every time I ask for the translation of these videos in other languages, English, French and so on. I cannot speak other languages. So, this specific work is all up to the conscience of the Italians who have awakened. Who know these messages and who can speak other languages. This is all up to them. Alberto, people speak of hope for the future. Do you think they are facing the whole situation in the right way? I do not think that people are facing this situation, in other words, this battle, in the right way. Hope is useless. Virgin Mary has always given us precise instructions and laws to put into practice. For example, all who draw the sword will die by the sword. If we do not reform, if we do not change our actions, all that is negative, all of the evil will come back. I can give you a clear and glaring example. In Fatima, in 1917, I already talked about the persecution of the Church by Communism, and especially by Russia. Now, she didn't say, you must hope it does not happen. Instead, she had made arrangements to be carried out. That is to consecrate Russia to the heart of Mary. We didn't carry that out, and this is very bad. In the present messages of today, the Holy Mother said, how much harm you could have saved yourself if only you had consecrated Russia to my immaculate heart. So what are we going to do? Ask the Vatican? I don't really think so, because they have hidden a crucial part of this very important secret themselves. But there is something new. The Polish Church ha has approved the apparitions in Trevignano Romano that we all know. So they showed openly their clear closeness to Jesus. What should we do? Let's ask the Polish Church to help us spread this request in the world. Because if we don't do anything, we won't get anything. But if we do something, for sure we will get something. So let's call the attention of the Polish Church Carbonia, 2010, try to stick together. I will never tire of repeating it. Keep together more than ever because you'll find strength right in the uniqueness of love. 2014, get ready to live in communities just like real sons of God. Tony Lagetta, he's a visionary from Lecce. It's a group of visionaries who are receiving Messages and Jenny received this one in 2014. Invoke the Virgin Mary. Satan is afraid of this. Once again, I tell you, be strong. Satan does not want your unity. Satan is afraid of Virgin Mary. In fact, for example, during exorcism, when you pray the rosary, the very exorcist said that this prayer has the same power 
of the prayers of exorcism. So Satan does not want our union and does not want that we unite together, connected with Mary. Michelino Marcovecchio, Manson, Tonofrio, Umbria, 2013. God the Father asks you for this unity. So as you see, it's a persistent message in many apparitions. He asks you for this strength in order to be stronger in the faith, because in this period Satan is very enraged. Trevignano Romano 2017, and here as well she repeats it. My children, all that awaits you will be very tough, but do not forget the immense protection you will get from the sky. As I told you before, if you will be faithful to my Jesus, be righteous and united in joy, love and charity, remember that you will need each other. It's clear she plainly asked for it. However, Virgin Mary asks and people do not act. We have seen the street protests, which unfortunately are going to get caught into a spiral of violence. Then what happens? People come back home and must face alone all of their problems. Or there are the WhatsApp and Telegram groups, but more often than not, they exchange videos and news, which are no doubt important, but there is not a real unity. My own goal is that the awakened people who are waiting for the second coming of Jesus unite each other in a practical way. They know each other, so I have launched an initiative on YouTube. In my channel, I have created a folder called Let's Join Together, and I'm telling you all of you, watch these videos very carefully. Why? If the people watching these videos will also put that into practice and become responsive, we could create a real and strong unity. For example, there are 100 people in Parma who are waiting for the second coming of Jesus. These 100 people must join each other with a mail address or a phone number. They must know each other. If in Turing there are 500 people waiting for the return of Christ, these people must get to know each other again with a mail address or a phone number. It's not that hard if you think about it. We can do it easily, but there is little response. Then, once people join each other, they can create communities, as I read earlier in that message. They can help the needy. We will help each other. That's what Our Lady said. You will need each other, or you can have prayer meetings, rosary meetings. But there is always this very huge problem. Unless a bomb goes off under their houses, unless they are missing their pasta dish, unless they get really scared, they do almost nothing. For pity's sake, I'm not saying this to criticize, but this is what I've seen. Moreover, I hope that this initiative will spread out of Italy too, so I hope as well this video is to be translated in other languages. What to say, Alberto? We are very glad to have been able to interview once again. We thank you for all that you do and that you disseminate about these topics, especially in these times that is crucial. And let's hope to see each other again. I am the one thanking you. It's been an honor for me. For sure, we are going to see each other again. You have been very kind. Thank you very much.